Hello and welcome back. This is Agent Zap. You're watching episode 3 of season 2 in the Learn Together Total War Attila playing as the Utes, the Viking Forefathers faction. So, where we last left off, we had just been declared on by the Franks because they feel they're very strong and we are not since I'm just now starting to build the second army which they apparently already have so what we're gonna do is recruit some more people we need good fighters. actually not those just want these and then we'll have these all right sounds good and We'll research the military maneuvers so we get some more units unlocked that we can use and then we'll retreat our ships so that we can hopefully fight the Frankish fleet. Um, Next off, let's talk My to friend, our hopefully ally in the future, the, gods bless the Saxons, who are fighting also against the Western Roman Empire and the Franks currently. And yeah, we'll do that. Sure. Let's see, anything else? Nothing that you would want? These we will glad to do you to want offers, to trade with me? Do not wrap them in love. Will you not you want a non-aggression? No, thank you. Let's see, how about military access? Nope. You don't really like me. That's kind of improving at least. So, let's change your stance. Why can I not? Because I'm recruiting. Makes sense. And then I can also not move because I'm recruiting. Okay. That's alright. Then we move the fleet to still be pillaging. Good. What's happening here? You are being sieged by the Picts, who have most likely many, many more troops than you do. Yeah, this Frankish attack is quite a distraction on our hopeful invasion in England. So hopefully we can get this over with quick. And once we get through this long, 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 long loading screen, we will. The Varenians. You have much, and our people do not wish to become the slaves of envy. You are at war with the Angles. I think that's okay. You are tributary straight of the Danes. Uh, that's okay. Well, I guess we'll trade with you for now. So you ended your war against the Danes because I think you were just at war with them. Who is getting married? This person. One of your subjects has become infatuated and wishes to marry his intended. Shall their union be allowed? Personal influence and cunning. That sounds good. I think I will do the gift blessing option. 
so this is that person I think yes he just got married you received one cunning from your wife and you will also receive one cunning when you are a commander so if I need a defender at some point in the future you are gonna be the choice you are in the fleet you are there and Torsten he is a son how old are you? six mm, it's okay you might just become my heir in the future can still not move how about changing your stance? Let's just move you down here. And then we'll cancel these orders. Move you into town. And then recruit some more of these as we just had planned. Well, we'll do that. Sounds good. We are down here. It's also good. And we'll end our turn. You level up. It's nice. Plus one on agent recruitment. So having you in the garrison would be better most likely and you are my commander of the sea I want you to loot and pillage so you're gonna get that trait let's see how this goes Picts are still fighting up here why can I not move the map that would be nice oh the Franks are coming and they killed the Saxon army Okay, that's scary. Let's see how we can f influence that, hopefully. Loading screens take forever in Total War. But who knows, maybe I just didn't read the options well enough that maybe there is a possibility that I could actually make this better. Garuf, uh, you are. Ready for battle! the governor I think yes we'll give you some trades Let's see you're all about the growth of the city zeal gives us more of that we need authority more food more cunning sounds also good we'll do that and more authority for you too that sounds good very nice let's see what else can we do we just had a new building we'll recruit some new people if we can Nordic pikemen and warhounds well, we'll do two of these complete at the village See, can I change your stance? Could become a raider or an ambusher. Let's see, these have full troops. Your troops are all but depleted. 
there's no troops in there. So if I make you into an ambush. A turn. Unfortunate. So the Saxons will maybe just be wiped out because I didn't take action fast enough and I forgot to move the raider ships. This is quailed the nail biter and you are beating up the Saxons non stop. Hopefully they can hold out long enough for us to come and reinforce. up to the angles are taking long but I can't see what they're doing oh well waiting 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 to make our move and we're done see what happened you have sired a little son okay trade matters our enemies profit from trade the mission failed well the angles didn't want that I've stayed sick Bjorn my lord, we should hold the fabulous feast, inviting the great engage in faction politics to deal with your subjects. Okay. Secured. That's the. Okay, with some woman. You have become of age it seems and you are the high king of the Saxons so you this will invite our neighbors uh, let's see you are being sieged your armies are so damaged. Well, but there is undefended. Do I not get to move? Also, I have to stay there where I set the ambush. Now that doesn't make sense. We'll go into no stance. Go attack him. We cannot. Right, we're suffering casualties because of the winter. That's bad. My reinforcements are stuck up here because we can't do it. Can't move down there. Unless I want to risk getting more casualties. Which I think we might just have to do. And then I will hire another. Which is you, I think. 
raise an army and you will recruit some people not inside my settlement. Why is that? I want hourly patrols. Now you will recruit. Fight with us. It's a good life. Death in battle? There is no finer ending. We need good fighters. Okay, that sounds good. Recruiting that. Some people Put down there. Get some mercenaries. good and our turn after we move our ships because I forgot about that last turn already and then we'll have to change our stance for next round next turn I think and the turn What will the Saxons do? As well as the Franks. They are retreating. That's good. Scared them off, that seems. Very nice. I mean took quite a lot of casualties in consequence but I think it's worth it not losing that ally Fleet or agent can reveal this information about rival armies, fleets, and settlements like in their better. immediate proximity or within their line of Angles sight. Trespass against the us. level of detail available depends on the type of character who is spying. Sure. So let's see. Did you raise any ships? You didn't. Patrol. Let's see how strong are you. You have suffered casualties. And you are the Saxons. Retreating. The other army I could see earlier. Can't see them now. Let's see about diplomacy. The angles. Like me well enough. Greetings. Now speak Will plainly, you trade? For we are an honest and folk and value honesty in others. Access. Nope. Only access and some payment. And the trade. Nope. <sighs> oh well. Then we'll just trespass again. Going down there. Can't attack him yet. But you should be able to. Let's exchange some troops. Um, some raiders. Let's 
some of these. Right. Uh, because I took the Ready for orders. troops that had already moved. That was bad. For the tribe. Well, another turn wasted. And I think I should have a look. They fighting them again. Alright. Well, that was an episode mostly lost to our allies. But I think the Franks should have been diminished quite a bit. So maybe we even gonna be able to conquer them in the next episode, I think. Since our time is up. So if you enjoyed the episodes, please leave a like leave a like, comment and subscribe for more content in the future. I will see you next week. And see you next time. You have recruited Bye -bye. so many